ಹೆಲೋ 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 ನಮಸ್ಕಾರ ಬೆಂಗಳೂರು ಅ ವಾಮ್ ವೆಲ್ಕಮ್ ಟು ಅವರ್ ಪಾರ್ಟ್ನರ್ಸ್ ಆರ್ ಫ್ರೆಂಡ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಮೀಡಿಯಾ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಆ ವೆರಿ 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 ಸ್ಪೆಷಲ್ ಶಾಮಿ ಫ್ಯಾನ್ಸ್ ಥ್ಯಾಂಕ್ ಯು ಸೋ ಮಚ್ ಫಾರ್ ಬೀಂಗ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ದಿಸ್ ಆಫ್ಟರ್ನೂನ್ ಮೈ ನೇಮ್ ಇಸ್ ಮುರ್ಲಿ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಐ ಆಮ್ ದ ಪ್ರೆಸಿಡೆಂಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಶಾಮಿ ಇಂಡಿಯಾ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ವಿ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಸಮ್ ಆಸ್ ಆಲ್ವೇಸ್ ಎಕ್ಸೈಟಿಂಗ್ ಸ್ಟಫ್ ಲೈನ್ ಅಪ್ ಫಾರ್ ಯು ದಿಸ್ ಆಫ್ಟರ್ನೂನ್ ಬಟ್ ಟು ಸೆಟ್ ದ ಕಾಂಟೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಶಾಮಿ ಇಸ್ ಬೀನ್ ಇನ್ ಇಂಡಿಯಾ ಫಾರ್ ದ ಪಾಸ್ಟ್ ನೈನ್ ಇಯರ್ಸ್ and what a journey it has been many of you have played a role in that and it fills us at charm india with a lot of pride just to look back on what all we have accomplished over the course of these 9 years today as of 2022 with our relentless focus on delivering innovation for everyone and democratizing technology for the masses we have achieved many milestones today we are india's number one smartphone brand india's number one smart television brand the market leaders in the smart security camera segment and the market leaders in the robo vacuum cleaner market too and this focus this focus on providing smarter lifestyles to people is something that we have also pursued globally across the globe we have over 558 million connected devices that's like half a billion isn't that crazy that's a number that we are very very proud of but it's not just about business it's not just about milestones for us at shami india what matters more is winning the love and trust of people and this is something that we are always committed to pursuing to be india's most loved and trusted smartphone brand and it fills me with a lot of pride it fills us with a lot of pride to be recognized as india's number one most trusted brand in smartphones thank you so much for making us that thank you but it's not just smartphones in fact as per this recent report released by tri research xiaomi india is the number two most trusted brand across all categories <laughs> ah. look words are not enough to thank you partners friends xiaomi fans everybody we are filled with gratitude for the love and affection that you have given us truly mean it at shami business and milestones are important but i think we are here for a larger purpose india has given us so much love so much affection and we believe it is our responsibility to give back to society and thank them for all that they have given us and towards this over the course of these 9 years we have executed to many social impact initiatives or corporate social responsibility initiatives and this year in 2023 we have identified three key themes behind our social impact projects number 1 supporting children in their education and i'll talk about the examples supporting children in their education providing skill building support to our youth and demonstrating our care and concern in sustainability and in our environment earlier this year we announced a partnership with the ace cricketer yuvraj singh's uv can foundation in supporting the education of 200 warriors and these are no ordinary children these are children perhaps facing the biggest adversity of their lives one of cancer and we wish them the very best we've also partnered with the saurav gongli foundation and child rights in you in ensuring that children can get back to school which was disrupted because of the covid pandemic and pursue their studies we've also partnered with united way india 
in ensuring that 4,000 children going to government schools have access to tinkering labs. And tinkering labs are those which ensure that there is a passion for sciences and a passion for STEM education is built up and fostered amongst our young generation so that India's future can also get secured. And to ensure that as a society, we are more diverse and inclusive, we have also sponsored an initiative that will support skill building for the transgender community so that they can pursue meaningful and respectful livelihood for themselves. And last but not the least, we've partnered with the Global Hunt Foundation in sponsoring a mobile hardware repair course for underprivileged youth so they can pursue this as their career opportunity. And I wish to thank each one of you for the feedback that you would keep providing us on these initiatives and many, many more that we will pursue in the future. Thank you. We really couldn't have done this without you. And on behalf of Xiaomi India today, we commit to continuing this endeavor. And in 2023, this endeavor focused on three key domains, like I mentioned, education of children, skill building of youth, and protecting our environment. And this is our responsibility. This is our commitment to this nation and this society. Now, talking about products, 2023, as with so many other years, it's been an interesting Q1. We started this year with uh, the Redmi Note 12 5G. Uh, many of you were there in Delhi for that launch. And that energy, that buzz in that hall, I get goosebumps thinking about it, right? Amazing vibe there. The Super Note series, all of you would remember. And then we launched a phone which, which honestly redefines smartphone photography, the Xiaomi 13 Pro. The flagship device co-engineered with Leica. More recently, a couple of weeks ago, we launched the Xiaomi 12C and the Redmi Note 12, and we've also launched a couple of entertainment devices, the 32-inch uh, television and the Xiaomi TV Stick 4K. And since this year is the 13th anniversary of Xiaomi's founding, for the past couple of weeks, we've been celebrating the Xiaomi Fan Festival. And I'm sure all of you would have checked out all the amazing offers that we have lined up, not just on me.com, but also our partner platforms, as well as in offline retail outlets. But Xiaomi is more than just a smartphone company. Through this wonderful multiplier effect, of smartphone times AIoT, we've always endeavored to make a difference to people and make their lifestyles smarter, which is largely the theme of this beautiful event that we have set up today, Smarter Living. Of course, we have a wonderful set of products that we have lined up to announce today. And to kick off the proceedings, I'll call upon stage the Chief Marketing Officer of Xiaomi India, Anuj Sharma. Welcome on stage, please. Thank you, Murli. Thank you, Murli. And a very warm welcome to all our Xiaomi fans. It's really great to have you guys here. Of course, really good to see our media friends and our partners also in this event. You know, this event, Smarter Living, is very special to all of us in Xiaomi. This is the part where we move away from just what Murli was saying. We are more than a smartphone brand. And we talk about how we can make everyone's lives better with our smart connected devices. Uh, this is also quite interesting. If you guys see the set, hope you guys like this. Uh, so Pallav and team came up with this concept. They think having these sketches leaves a big canvas for you guys to imagine what could possibly fit in in your homes. Right? So that actually adds to it. Uh, I probably also gave a couple of hints. So if you see around the stage, you'll get an idea of what's coming up. Uh, so Smarter Living started in 2018, but that was not the first time we were launching smart products. In fact, our first ever smart product in India was back in 2016. And that presentation started with a particular slide. 
and that slide was this, right? In 2016, when we talked about air pollution, that was becoming a concern, and 10 out of the top 20 cities across the world were in India. That's obviously a cause of concern, and something that we wanted to help tackle at least at an individual level or a family level. Fast forward to last year, six years later, things should have improved, right? Nope. Last year, we were at 15 out of the top 20 cities in the world. Now, that air situation obviously is getting bad. But there's another aspect of air pollution. When all of us talk about air pollution, we talk about smog, we talk about the winter months, but it's a lot more than this. It's actually even today. So this is the data from March. And if you look at the key cities, and actually I've also lived in some of these cities uh, in the past, even in March, these were at hazardous levels. These are not safe for breathing air. Uh, and this air situation, you know, while obviously you can't, oh, as a company, we can't tackle outside, but our objective with our products, especially the air purifier line of products, has been to keep you guys safe. And this has been a great lineup. So we started in 2016 with the Air Purifier 2. I'm sure some of you guys were there at that launch. But from there, we've moved on every single time. In 2018, at the Smarter Living event, uh, we had the Air Purifier 2S. This, actually, I really love. And I have a personal story. I'll talk about it later. In 2019, in the Smarter Living event, we had launched 2C. And later that year, we also launched the Mi Air Purifier 3. Now, all of these are fundamental products in our minds. You know, what we think from Maslow's hierarchy of needs, at a physiological level, you need some basic stuff, right? You need shelter, of course. You need food, you need water, and you need air. Now, if I talk about food, you can easily go without food for a few days without impacting your health. A few of us probably can go for a few weeks, easy. We've got that much in store. Uh, but if I ask you to hold back on water, within a day, you'll start feeling those effects. Within three, it gets into a red zone. But if I talk about air, if I just ask all of you guys in this room to hold your breath for a minute, see what happens. You can't even do that. Air is that essential. Now, now imagine if you had dirty water to drink. Right? Would you do that? No, right? or bad food that's going to give you stomach poisoning, and you know it, you would not eat that food. Why do we continue to breathe that air? Right? What can we do about it? And that's where this particular product comes into play. Uh, the Air Purifier 3, which was our last launch, had amazing reviews. Uh, everyone's loved this. Uh, people have used it for, say, allergens. People have used it for pet allergies. Uh, obviously, the fact that it's lightweight, it's silent, is a massive bonus because you want this to be next to you wherever you might be. Uh, but I have a personal story like I was mentioning earlier. So back in 2018, uh, we did this Smarter Living launch. That was also in Bangalore, and that was in Leela. I don't know how many of you guys were there at that point in that launch. It was a very fun event. And after that event, when we launched the Air Purifier 2C, 2S, sorry, uh, the 2S, I got one home. Now, I'll probably go back further. Let me go back 13 years from that point. What happened was I moved to Bangalore. And I had, like I said, I had been staying in some of those really polluted cities that keep popping up, right? So high AQI, red zone. I had stayed there as a kid. You knew when you had to cover your you know, face, you were going out in a smoking environment. I didn't really develop any problems till I came to Bangalore. Now, a year in, when I was in Bangalore, I started developing some amount of respiratory issues. Uh, over the next couple of years, it kept getting worse every single time. In fact, a lot of times, I would wake up at 4 in the morning not being able to breathe properly. Uh, so I went to see a doctor, and the doctor said, you've got the Bangalore allergy. Essentially, what he meant was it's the pollen that's known for creating allergies in Bangalore. Now, that's something we didn't really think of. We were thinking, you know, pollution is essentially the smoke and stuff that you see, but allergies, can that be a big problem? Well, it was. 
And for me, that continued. So I, I took nasal drops, I had medication, and that went on for almost about 10 odd years. And then after that Smarter Living uh, event, I, I took the, the 2S because it, it looked so cool. So I said, I gotta have this cool looking thing in my bedroom. So I put this in the bedroom. And a few weeks later, those symptoms started going down. And a couple of months later, it was gone. And now I don't even actually carry a handkerchief with me because earlier I would have these sneezing bouts because of the allergy coming in. And what I realized was, while I was prepared for the outside air, I never thought about what was happening inside my own home. Right? Those pollutants, those pollen, all that were inside. And uh, you know, that probably is, again, a, a review here. So probably you can add a seventh review from me uh, in terms of how good our air purifiers have been. So all of these purifiers have been brilliant, but today we're going to step it up and take it to the next level. So let me introduce to you the Xiaomi Smart Air Purifier 4. I absolutely love the aesthetics. It fits into any decor. Actually, sometimes I think it even uplifts a particular decor. It looks as good as always, but there's more to it. So this one does a lot more, right? Now, what does it really tackle? Let me talk about the pollutants. And I've split this into two aspects, what you can see and what you cannot see. Because as human beings, we tend to react to things that we can see, right? So obviously, you have smoke. Whenever you see smoke, that's the first thing that comes to your mind, pollution. You also have industrial pollution. We've all seen this big chimney bellowing out black smoke. And you know, if you're driving past it, you look at it saying, Kuch to karna iske right? we don't do anything about it. The next one is automotive. If you are driving a bike, I'm sure at one point of life, you've been stuck behind a truck which has not gone through any servicing for 10 years. And that also lets this entire smoke into your face, right? Pollutant. Pet hair is another aspect, pet hair and dander. Now we love our furry friends, but sometimes they can lead to certain health problems. So you wanna take care of that part as well. But then the more dangerous ones, the ones that you cannot see, dust. Now there's dust in every room, right? And that floats in the air. And with dust is also dust mites. Now we've not shown that here, probably becomes a little too graphic, but you can imagine small little mites that can cause health problems. You've got invisible matter, PM10, PM2.5. This is something that we have learned to measure with all the AQI charts, but there's pollens as well. Now, I actually faced the pollen allergy part of it, and it was quite severe. And the last one, uh, which is something that I don't think any of us consider, cooking fumes. Now, next time you're making that alu parantha or a puri at home, your air purifier will tell you how much of that is getting affected or how much of that is affecting the air itself. Now that also adds to the pollution within your four walls. You don't consider it because obviously it smells good at times, but uh, it is also a pollutant. And to tackle all of these pollutants, we are basically launching the air purifier four. But uh, what we're gonna do is talk about what it can do, actually not talk about, but show you what it can do. So maybe as a demo, if we can just add the visible pollutants to the box. Can we get some smoke in there, please? All right, that's quite a lot of smoke. <laughs> All right, so now you can see this. Uh, can, while I talk about how good this purification is, can we also turn the air purifier on? So while it do its job. On? All right, it's on. So let's do its magic. You can already see the air moving. But let me talk about the first big upgrade that you have in this, the filter. Now, obviously, you've got a pre-filter that takes care of the big debris. 
but you also add a true HEPA filter, which takes care of the smaller particles, the ones that you can see and you cannot see, the pollen, the PM2.5. And then, this is probably my favorite, new addition, you add, have activated charcoal filter. Now, this has 83% more activated charcoal than the previous generation. How does it help you? One, smoke. Second, odors. The third one, which also is quite important, and we've mentioned that up top, formaldehyde. Now, you might not notice this, but when you're painting your walls or you've brought in a new furniture that has a particular polish, it could be giving out gases that are harmful for you. So it takes care of that part. And we've also added a negative air ionizer, which helps with this cleaning even better. Oh, it's already clean. Damn, OK. I've not finished one slide as well. Uh, so this obviously cleans really quickly. But uh, OK, I, I should not be doing this, but I'm going to do this. Uh, what happens, <laughs> sorry, what happens if you give the Xiaomi Air Purifier 4 to Robert Downey Jr.? He becomes negative Ion Man. <laughs> uh, damn. Okay. Sorry about that. So as you can see, it cleaned up that air really, really quickly. How does it do this? Because it's also a lot more efficient than ever before. It can cover a larger area, uh, all the way from 301 square feet to a 516 square foot room space, probably. Uh, in certain cities, your entire house, uh, it can kind of handle that part. And we've also improved the CADR, or clean air delivery rate. It goes all the way to 400 cubic meter per hour. So that box happens to be just four cubic meters. And that's why it was able to clean that before I could finish one slide. Uh, so it's as efficient as that one. So our most advanced air purifier till date, but we've made things even better. It's also got improved 360-degree air suction. Uh, our previous air purifiers had this uh, latch at the back where you could remove the air filter, but that did not let in that much air compared to the new one. So we've made this one as porous as possible, so it's taking in air from all sides and dispersing it up top so you get clean air every single time. And the last one is how quiet can it be? Now, before I talk about how quiet our air purifier is, I just wanted to talk about the decibel meter. I'm sure a lot of you guys understand this, but I'll again reiterate, this is not a linear scale. This is logarithmic. For example, if I move from 80 decibels to 60 decibels, it is not 33% quieter. It is actually 10 times quieter. Right? So that's how this works. When I move from 60 to a 40, which is basically, if you're listening to music, to average home noise, depending on what your house is, uh, it is again 10 times quieter. So where would the air purifier 4 fit in? Well, it is whisper quiet. At just 32.1 dB, it's absolutely amazing to have this in your room. It is not really a disturbance. It runs extremely quiet. In fact, in most cases, our outside noise will still continue to overpower what you can hear from the air purifier. Does not really disturb your sleep. But in case, it's not just the noise, but if you see the indicator and that light disturbs you, when you put it in sleep mode, we'll also turn off that indicator as well. You have on auto mode, so depending on the room conditions, it'll automatically step up the fan whenever it needs to. But in overall sleep mode, it is whisper quiet, it has no disturbance, it's perfect for your bedroom. Uh, how quiet though? If I had to compare it with, say, another air purifier, which is about 50,000 rupees, it is almost five times quieter. It's again, decibel scale. Uh, and I think it also kind of looks a lot more modern. Uh, but that's, that's another thing, that's subjective. Uh, talking about the display. Now this is an OLED display indicator. Uh, and it has a bunch of things. The big numbers that you see up top is the PM 2.5 indicator. But beyond that, you're also seeing the temperature and humidity in your home. That little minus thing that you see is obviously Iron Man. Uh, this is the negative ion uh, aspect that's been switched on. You can switch on or off depending on how you like it. Uh, it's connected to Wi-Fi. That's the Wi-Fi signal. And it's in auto mode. And that, whenever you change the mode, you'll be able to see this. 
you've got the overall environment indicator below that, that's the green part. And we've also added two buttons in, within the touch screen itself. Now the idea here is not everyone would want to reach out to your smartphone or a tablet to turn on and off this or turn or change the modes. You can do that right from the panel itself. Uh, or if you're not home and somebody else wants to do that, you can also do that. Uh, if the pollution starts going up, that green turns into yellow. Further up, it turns into orange. And of course, at a certain point, above about 55 AQI within your house, it starts turning red, which also lets you know uh, if you need to change the, the mode, for example, if it was not an auto mode, you can kind of do that. Uh, the other big factor for someone like me, who had this massive OCD with the previous generation uh, uh, air purifiers, I could always change the filter, but I couldn't get to the fan. Now finally, finally, we can open the top. It needs a bit of work, but all of us, I mean, at least all of us here are very technically savvy. We can easily open this, uh, use a microfiber cloth to clean the fan. It's as good as new. Uh, fun fact, when you're looking at this, the grill. Now this grill has been designed specifically so that it has uniform and maximum airflow across the room. But there's one more thing here. Each of those grills is designed in such a way that if you have small children in your house, and we all know small children, even when we were small, we'd like to poke our finger into that fan. Right? So this one does not let you do that. So it's also child-friendly in a way that you will not have anyone poking and stuff there. Uh, so yeah, a pretty cool feature. I think uh, a great add-on to entire Xiaomi culture where we get to do things on our own, and we do that. Obviously, it's a smart air purifier, which basically means it has all the connected functions. Yes, remotely, I can be sitting here and turning on the air purifier at home. I can time it. For example, my air purifier at home turns on at 9.30 p.m. every day and turns off at 5.30 a.m. Yes, that's the time I wake up, flex, uh, <laughs> where we do that. Uh, you can change all the settings. Uh, you can also monitor the air quality. So for example, if this is in your kid's room or your parent's room, without having to go there on your phone, you can see if all the air is looking fine. Uh, it also lets you know if the filter needs a change. And if that needs a change, within the app, uh, you can click. It'll take you to me.com. You can order the right filter for your air purifier. So that is the smart air purifier 4. Uh, it'll really make you love the air you breathe. It has a large coverage area, uh, better 360 degree air filtration, an amazing new filter with 83% more activated carbon. Uh, it continues to be as compact and portable as ever before, even with the enhanced stats and enhanced performance. Uh, really low noise, just whisper quiet at 32 decibels. And when it's running in sleep mode at night, it just consumes three watts of power. That's less than your LED bulb running. Right? I think that's a fair price to pay for health. Uh, of course, it is smart, and it also can be controlled via Google or Alexa. Uh, so just a voice away, you can ask it to turn on or off your air purifier. So let's take a look at all the enhancements that we've done over the years from 2016 coming in to today. Uh, better CADR, better coverage area, better filtration, better air suction, uh, just continues to be just as quiet. We've added an ionizer, uh, we've added formaldehyde absorption, and of course, made the touch control even better than before. So let's take a look at a quick product video for the Air Purifier 4. Sure, you guys are going to love this, 
But what happens if you don't really need that much power or you need it for, say, a home office or a smaller place? We are also introducing another air purifier, this, sorry, the Smart Air Purifier 4 Lite. Now, this also brings in a whole lot of features uh, from the Air Purifier 4. The same new and improved filter, so you get better filtration, even odors, carbon, and formaldehyde. You have obviously all the smart connected uh, aspects from the Xiaomi Home app and an even smaller footprint. Uh, in fact, the footprint is almost the size of an A4 sheet. So it hardly takes up space. Perfect for example, a home office or a one bedroom house and things like that. Uh, now this one also kind of has TUV Rhineland certification is also whisper quiet at just 33.4 decibels. So in fact, this makes it a perfect complement if you are taking the air purifier four, and between these two, they can easily cover most of your home needs. The air purifier four brings in more CADR, more coverage, while the air purifier light uh, brings in a smaller footprint, and of course, being a lighter version, uh, better economics to it. So let's take a quick look at the four light as well. <laughs> next product, and perhaps my favorite category of all times. Let's move from clean air to cleaner homes. Uh, this is an interesting story where back in 2020, I was one of the first beta testers for this device in the country. I got it around January, and I was testing this on a daily basis. And in March of 2020, uh, we had the pandemic come in. We were all locked in. Uh, and you know, we couldn't really get household help, we couldn't have anyone else coming in. Uh, but at that point in Xiaomi, we still had a whole lot of things happening. If you guys remember, we had just launched the Note 9 Pro, Note 9 Pro Max, we had a whole bunch of other products coming in, uh, including the, I think now I can obviously say this because we've launched it three years ago, but we had the Mi 10 coming in. Uh, so we were still at hard at work, even when we were at home. Uh, so we used to have these meetings at 9.30 in the morning every single day. So our teams would get together saying what's happening, you know, uh, how things are working out, have you got the samples, have you got the software right, uh, how are the tests looking like. So while we were doing all of this, there was one particular pattern. Every day at 9.30, I would be bright and fresh, uh, I would sit in that meeting, and on that Zoom call, half the team looked really, really tired. So I asked, after about three or four days, I asked them saying, guys, what's up? So they said uh, three reasons. First reason, jhadu. Second, pocha. Third, jhadu pocha. <laughs> Essentially, uh, sweeping and mopping. We never realized how much work or effort that was going in if we had any sort of help earlier. Uh, so later on in 2020, we had announced, I think, a game changer for the industry, the Mi Robot Vacuum Mop P. Now this went on to become a bestseller, and last year, we upgraded it to the MOP2 Pro. Now these devices have done exceedingly well for large households. People uh, obviously see this as amazing value for what it delivers, uh, but the MOP2 Pro even is able to mop things even better. Right? So we had advanced uh, features there. It was able to cover larger homes because of larger battery. It had larger suction, uh, so it could pick up even bigger, heavier debris. Uh, and obviously consumers have absolutely loved this one. But then we were thinking, that it's not just that. Right? A lot of our team members today come into Bangalore, uh, they're staying alone, they're staying in a, a smaller apartment, they don't really need this much power. And for those people, today, 
we are introducing all new robot vacuum mop 2i Stop now. Right. Now this one also gives you smart cleaning on command. And I think this is probably our sleekest looking vacuum mop to date. It looks absolutely stunning. But we'll talk a lot more about this. Uh, now this also has powerful suction to pick up debris, dust, uh, hair, all of that stuff at home and clean it on the go. It is smart so you can do that from anywhere. But we've also enhanced a whole bunch of new sensors. So this has a new gyroscope and optical sensor-aided navigation. So it moves around more efficiently within your four walls. But not just these two. In fact, we've added 25 high-precision sensors. So there's, of course, a wall sensor. Because of that wall sensor, it's now able to get closer to the walls before it turns around, so you can get that edge cleaning more effectively. Or my favorite is it's also got a cliff sensor. Now, the cliff sensor means that if it detects a fall, it will not drop off. Right? So if you've got stairs, if you've got any kind of height difference in your home, you can uh, be rest assured that the, this guy will not fall off. Let's try that, actually. So we, since yesterday, we've been trying to push it off the edge, like all ba bad friends. Uh, it's not dropped off yet. And it doesn't let it drop. So this one, we are trying to push it off the edge in a manual mode. So it does this little Rithik dance, uh, which is really cool. <laughs> uh, but not just that. It also has a wheel speed sensor. So for example, if it detects an open space in front of it, it can go a little faster. It's got a collusion sensor, so it's not hitting anything that any objects that you might have left there intentionally or unintentionally. And of course, it has a docking sensor, so it knows where to go back and dock uh, when it needs to recharge or when it's done with that cleaning. But it also cleans better. So we've also got an all-new zigzag cleaning method, which ensures that no part of your house is missed out when you've got the mop 2 i doing its work. So sensors, better sensors, better cleaning method, overall a much better experience for people getting started with this experience. Uh, we've got a large 450 milliliter dust compartment and a 270 ml electronically controlled water tank. By this, when it's mopping, it controls how much water you want it to kind of let out so that you don't really have any puddles, pools, or a wet ground once it's done with that mopping. So it does that really efficiently. And like we saw with the zigzag method, it covers the entire house really well. And as you can see, the profile is quite different, which also means it's able to tackle its number one enemy. The number one enemy for all robot vacuum cleaners furniture. So it's able to go below sofas, beds. In fact, if you guys saw this, it came from under a sofa. So there was a nice little touch here. Uh, so it's compact enough to slip under that, uh, clean under the sofas, places that you can't reach, under the bed, right? where I guess a lot of you guys haven't cleaned for the last two months. Right? This can do that. So you also have that compact size advantage coming in. Now, this is also smartly controlled, which basically means with the app, you can obviously turn on and off this. So even if you're not at home, you can command it to clean the house. Say if you're coming back home and you also have friends coming in, by the time you get back, it would have cleaned the house. Uh, but you can also choose if you want to vacuum, vacuum and mop, or just mop. And so you have that. Within mopping, you can choose how much water level you want to use, low, mid, high. And obviously, when it's vacuuming, you can choose between four modes, all the way from silent to turbo. Uh, as you can see, in silent mode, you can even hear it on the first row. So it's great when you are at home and it's cleaning around you. It's not really a disturbance, even for your phone calls and things like that. This also works with Google Assistant and Alexa. So finally, you can shout at someone to clean your house, and it gets the work done. So the robot vacuum mop 2i, powerful suction. 2,200 pascals, 
compact and portable, goes under your furniture really easily. Furniture, bed, finally get that spot cleaned. Uh, with that zigzag cleaning, it will not miss it. Has a large dust compartment, has a large water tank, has 25 high precision sensors to ensure it knows exactly where it's going and completes the house in time. Uh, so that also kind of adds to our portfolio. We've got the MOP2 Pro and the MOP2i. MOP2 MOP2 Pro is for those people who need that extra space, who need that extra battery life, while the MOP2i can easily cover about 1,200 square foot or about 100 minutes of cleaning on a single charge, uh, giving it a really great uh, cleaning capabilities and a great starting uh, robot vacuum MOP2i with all the smart features that you expect from a Xiaomi smart device. So let's take a look at the video for this. next product. Now this next product uh, was first launched in 2019 by our famous Beard Gang. And that was, that's been a fun journey for the last three and a half years. But there's one person in our team who always wanted to get into the Beard Gang but unsuccessfully could not. Uh, but today he has an option or he has a chance to come and introduce the next product on his own calling on stage Gautam Batra. Thank you, Anuj. Thank you, Anuj. A very warm welcome to everyone. I'm Gautam Batra. Uh, Anuj talked about three really good products under two categories, the Air Purifier 4, the Air Purifier 4 Lite, and the MOP 2i. Uh, While well, these will ensure that you have cleaner air around you and a cleaner house, what about cleaner you? And that's why we did an India-only specific category launch, which is personal grooming. Now, the first product that we launched was the Mi Trimmer, the Mi Beard Trimmer, and it met with huge success. We were able to sell more than 3 million units of it. That's 30 lakh unit plus. And that's the numbers. I mean, fans love us. If we launch something, they are going to buy it. And of course, with the love of fans, we can definitely do numbers like this, but we also wanted to see what feedback did they have for us. And we saw the reviews. Uh, for example, Gopinath really loves the battery life. He has used other brand streamer, and he knows that the charging experience can be really bad. And this one comes with like a really good charging time as well as a good battery life. Pranav has, feels that you know, the precision, the sharpness of the blade is really what he wants from the trimmer. And Nit Nitesh feels that you know, it's a no-brainer, it's a clear recommendation for everyone. In fact, it is the highest rated trimmer on Flipkart. But you know, how do you go beyond the perfect product, right? If you know that you're better than any of the competition, how do you go further and improve on it? Well, we thought that we will definitely take it to the next level for two particular reasons. A, our engineers who were you know, doing the first product back in 2019 now had a good understanding how the product works, what can be done better, better, how can we increase efficiencies. And because we sold 3 million, we also got consumer feedback. And there were three things that we wanted to focus on. We wanted to make it more versatile, we wanted to last longer, and we wanted to charge easy. And keeping these three things in mind, presenting to you the Xiaomi Beard Trimmer 2C. I have the trimmer with me, 
And with this, you can trim and transform. And if you look at it, it comes with the same premium design that the Xiaomi Beard Trimmer is known for. It's really compact, really lightweight, and it's a really nice product overall. So how did we go about the three things? Uh, everyone loves the precision. I showed you like how Pranav really likes the precision of the product, and it comes with the same precision of 0.5 mm. But to make it more versatile, we have doubled on the lens settings. From 20 lens settings, it is going to 40 lens settings, all the way from 0.5 mm to 20 mm. We even made it last longer. Earlier, it used to be 60 minutes of runtime. We increased it by 50%, and now it does 90 minutes of runtime. And it comes with Type-C charging. Now, talking about the battery life, 90 minutes is a lot of time. You, if you trim for three minutes, you can easily go beyond a month. I even, like, recently I shifted my house, and I lost my trimmer. Uh, and you know, when I recovered it, it was after about a month, uh, and it still had three dots, which is more than 60% of battery life. So that's a great standby time on this. And you know, given the fact that if you know your, your trimmer lasts this long, you know, it's okay to forget your cable. It, you know, you're not going to carry your cable along with you. So if you have a phone, a tablet, a laptop, you can just use the cable to charge the trimmer. And in just five minutes, it can give you 10 minutes of trim trimming time. So that's the Beer Trimmer 2C. Uh, it comes with the same precision that our fans enjoy. Comes with 40 lens setting, 90 minute of runtime, Type C charging, a travel friendly pouch, and a safety lock to ensure that it does not go off and it's packed. Here's a quick look at the video. This cricket season, the Beard Gang is back, and they're here to ace the styling game a game of skill, style, and precision that demands the finest tools, like the cool new Xiaomi Beard Trimmer 2C. With its 0.5mm precision and 40 length settings, the Xiaomi Beard Trimmer 2C helps you achieve the perfect line and length for your beard. And its nifty LED indicator is your smart scoreboard, so you know how much power you need to finish the job. The Xiaomi Beard Trimmer 2C is a game changer in its speed and stamina, charging like a tracer bullet with a USB Type-C port. Just 5 minutes of charging gets you 10 minutes runtime, while a full charge is enough to last up to 4 weeks. It is smooth in your hands and on the move. With washable attachments, a safety lock and a travel pouch that are both travel and kid friendly, the Xiaomi Beard Trimmer 2C is ready to play. Are you? Now, this is what Anuj was talking about. That's the Beard Gang. These are all Xiaomi employees. They do not invite me to their video shoots. Uh, so I thought I might as well present their product. Uh, so, I mean, the Beard Trimmer will take care of, you know, majority of fans who just want to trim, who want to go to work. Uh, you know, it works for them. But there is a set of people who want more than a trimmer. You know, like the Beard Trimming is great, but I want to do head-to-toe -to -toe grooming. For them, we are announcing the Xiaomi Grooming Kit your all-in-one quality grooming destination. Now, it comes with all the goodness of the Beard Trimmer uh, 2C. So, you know, you get the battery life, uh, you get the Type-C, you get the convenience, you get the premium design, but you also get multiple attachments. For example, you get the body grooming head, you get the nose and ear trimmer head, you get precision blade if you want to really go and style your beard, you get the classic U-blade, and you get two combs to, that goes from 0.5 mm to 20 mm. So that's the grooming kit, comes with the, all the goodness of uh, the Beard Trimmer 2C, Type-C, 90 minutes of runtime, comes with multiple washable attachments, comes with a travel-friendly pouch, comes with safety lock as well, and a 90 minutes runtime. So that's the grooming kit. Here's a quick look at the video. Gentlemen, it's cricket season, and the Beard Gang is back with the new Xiaomi grooming kit. Just like a top T20 team, we've assembled a set of tools that helps you groom from head to toe. Gone are the days when a single blade was good enough for the whole pitch. Uh, we mean the whole body. This is the age of specialists. U-shaped blades are your openers to start with your beard. Next come the precision blades to achieve clean cuts and sharp lines. Then the body grooming head, power players for the tricky parts of your body, gentle on skin, tough on hair. And finally, the finishers of precision for your nose and ears. 
the Xiaomi Grooming Kit is a real all-rounder. Equipped with an LED indicator, washable attachments, a safety lock and travel pouch that are both travel and kid-friendly. And its USB Type-C port charges super fast. Just 5 minutes of charging gets you 10 minute runtime. A full charge lasts you up to 4 weeks. So get your grooming game on point with the new Xiaomi Grooming Kit. So that's the latest in our personal grooming portfolio. Uh, so that's it from my side. And to pass it on to our in-house industry camera expert to talk about a product that does not come with a camera. Let me call up on stage Sandeep. Thank you, Gautam. Xiaomi fans, are you enjoying Smarter Living? Yeah. Okay, great energy. And I think, like Murli was saying, we really enjoyed the infectious energy earlier this year with the Supernote launch. Can we bring the house down once again? Come on, guys. Pump it up, pump it up. All right, I'm Sandeep, and I'm really excited to be here to talk about a category which Xiaomi India added to its portfolio in 2018. Now, this is a category that we did not expect to do so well because over the past couple of years, since 2018, the smart TV category has helped influence millions of people around India and we have total uh, overall sales of exceeding 10 million units. So that's how popular the smart TV category has been in India for Xiaomi. Now, the Xiaomi TV philosophy is something that's very important to understand before we get into the product that we're launching today. This consists of three pillars, or three Cs that we call it. The first one being a content-first experience. So we believe that with smart TVs, content should be at the forefront and center. But we also believe that we should have a consistent TV experience. And this means that regardless of which TV you buy across our portfolio, you still get amazing hardware and breathtaking software as well. We also believe that the requirements of users depends on the region. Especially in India, with a varied customer base, the requirements are quite different, and we really needed to cater to the demands of all Indians, and that's why we believe in customization, especially for our Indian audience. Now, on, 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 on terms of you know, the portfolio itself, if you start, we have our HD-ready as well as Full HD TVs in the A-series, namely the 5A and 5A Pro. Now, these come in 32, 40, and 43-inch sizes. And then when you go up, you have the 4K HDR capable TVs in the X series. So we launched this last year. So Xiaomi uh, Smart TV X series basically has 43, 50, and 55 inch screen sizes. And this comes with 4K HDR capabilities. Now when you look at something that's more premium, that's more high end, you have the OLED Vision TV. This truly represents the pinnacle when it comes to TV technology. And the OLED vision is something that got raving reviews, especially thanks to Dolby Vision IQ and several other high-end technologies. Well, that left room to be desired, a missing portion of the puzzle, which we will solve for today. Before we dive into that, let me briefly explain the X series. So the X series was our way of providing innovation to everyone, which is something we believe at Xiaomi. We believe that everyone should have access to great technology, and the X-Series brings 4K HDR technology to everyone's reach very easily. And that's especially important because back in 2018, when we actually introduced this category, the overall number of content pieces out there was only a handful that is available in 4K. But since then, there has been a crazy high-end trend in India of rise in 4K content consumption. Now, the reason for this is threefold. Number one, now you have over millions of hours of content that is available in 4K. You also have great number of applications supporting streaming and OTT platforms supporting 4K streaming. And most recently, you also have live streaming of sports especially, namely the top two sports in India, cricket and football, in 4K resolution. Now, presenting to you the Xiaomi Smart TV X Pro series, which is the latest and best in the house of Xiaomi. Thank you. Doesn't that look amazing? Okay, now on to what exactly makes this a pro TV, right? 
I think there are four major things that we would like to talk about, starting with the design. As you can see, it comes with a premium metal bezel-less display, uh, metal -less, uh, premium metal bezel-less design with a high screen to body ratio of 96.6%. And like Anuj was mentioning, like our air purifier, this too will elevate the entire aesthetic in your home. But what is most important in a TV is often the display as well. A high speed to body ratio of 96.6%, premium metal design, and that brings us to the display itself. Display is something that we really wanted to empower, and we really wanted to bring the premium features that you had on the TV, such as OLED Vision, to the X series. And that's why with the X Pro, we're giving you a 4K HDR panel, but also introducing wide color gamut for the very first time in X series. We're also giving you SDR 10 plus capability, as well as our in-house image tuning, which is Vivid Picture Engine 2. Now, this gives true to live visuals, amazing colors, great vibrancy, and overall, takes your visual game to the next level. And of course, we also have one of the best technologies when it comes to displays, which is Dolby Vision. Now, Dolby Vision is something that you have to really experience and can't be told. So here's a quick video showcasing the capabilities of Dolby Vision. So breathtaking, isn't it? I mean, compared to your regular HDR or even SDR, this gives you much better contrast, more punchier colors, and great dynamic range. Now, about the pro part that we were talking about earlier, how exactly do you make a TV pro? And how do you bring some of the premium features that we saw, especially in the pinnacle of TVs, that is the OLED vision, down to this? The simple answer to this was bringing technology called Dolby Vision IQ. So this. Dolby Vision IQ is a breathtaking technology which also makes use of a built-in ambient light sensor. So you would have probably noticed when we brought out the TV, the brightness was automatically getting adjusted, and that's because this has a built-in ambient light sensor. So not only is it able to dynamically adjust the overall brightness of the TV, but the overall color temperature and various other parameters that truly makes your visual stunning, that can be adjusted using the built-in uh, ambient light sensor and Dolby Vision IQ technology. Now, to explain more about this, we have uh, someone who we consider uh, very, very close, the director of marketing at Dolby Vision, Samir, to talk more about this. So here's a quick video. Hello, everyone. This is Samir Seth from Dolby. All of us at Dolby are super excited to work again with Xiaomi to deliver a premium living room experience with the new generation Dolby Vision IQ and Dolby Atmos enabled Xiaomi Smart TV X Pro series. Dolby Vision with highlights 40 times brighter and blacks that are 10 times darker than a standard picture makes entertainment come alive. And Dolby Vision IQ dynamically adjusts to the changing light in the room and to the type of content being played back, leveraging the full intelligence of your Xiaomi TV to deliver a perfect picture in your room at every moment. Dolby Atmos immerses you in your favorite entertainment with sound that moves all around you with breathtaking realism. In terms of content, there are multiple hours of content available in both Dolby Vision and Dolby Atmos that consumers can experience today from leading global and Indian streaming services in multiple Indian languages. Once you experience it on your new Xiaomi a Smart TV X Pro series, there's no going back. We wish to thank our friends at Xiaomi for their valued partnership. We at Dolby will continue to work with Xiaomi to deliver spectacular experiences and we wish them all the best with this new launch. With this, back to you, Sandeep. Thank you, Samir. I think that really showcases the capabilities of Dolby Vision IQ. 
And fun fact, if you have a Xiaomi 13 Pro, you can capture videos on Dolby Vision and in fact view it in its full potential on our brand new X Pro series devices. Now, we have three different sizes for this. We have the 55 inch, which is the largest. We have a 50 inch, which sits in the middle. And we also have a 43 inch TV. Now, earlier I spoke about a consistent TV experience. Now, this just does not talk about the software, but even in terms of hardware. And that's why this 43 inch TV also comes with Dolby Vision IQ technology. And this is India's only TV in 43 inches to come with Dolby Vision IQ. Now, a great visual experience also needs great acoustics. To that end, we have ensured that the audio on this is absolutely stellar. We have 40 watt speakers that provide incredibly immersive and enriching sound. And to complement Dolby Vision and Vision IQ, you have Dolby Atmos. So the best from a visual acoustic experience, and you have DTS X as well. In terms of connectivity, you have everything in terms of wired and wireless connections. You have an ambient light sensor, as I mentioned earlier. And we also have a far field mic, which I shall talk about very, very soon. Last, but certainly not the least, what exactly makes a smart TV smart is the software, which is crucial to its experience. This is the first Xiaomi smart TV to come with Google TV. What this means is that you have seamless, fast, and quick performance, but it also brings in a host of other features, including multiple user profiles. So be it with your friends or family, you can configure it according to your own taste and have different user profiles so that it becomes easier to switch modes when the person changes who is watching the content. In terms of the far field mic, like I mentioned earlier, you have a quick wake word. You just say, hey, Google. And I hope I didn't trigger anyone's assistant here. But once you say, hey, Google, you can ask it your favorite things or questions or use it to find your favorite content as well. Patch wall. Now, I think back in 2018, when we launched you know, the Mi TV 4 on Feb 14th, most people did not really understand what software on TV men, uh, meant, truly. Software, I think, was more of a passive thing. And when people spoke about smart TVs as well, TVs were not really smart. They really did not do much. But with Patchwall, it completely redefined people's expectations and people's user experience when using software on TVs. Patchwall has very clever buckets into which it can sort content. We have also partnered with YouTube to have a music category, which is somewhat of a rarity, especially in smart TVs. And my favorite feature, which is universal search. So you, you no longer need to choose which OTT platform, then search for the content, and then choose whether to watch it or not. Just search for it, and it'll tell you which OTT platform has it, and it'll also give you ratings, and you can choose whether you want to watch it or not, and choose what is the latest and best so that you spend your time wisely. So that is the Xiaomi Smart TV X Pro series, the latest and best from the house of Xiaomi. It's a truly breathtaking design, premium metal bezel with a high screen to body ratio of 96.6%. And I really love the way it looks. The ambient light sensor is pretty awesome, not just adjusting brightness, but it also helps us in our 4K HDR panel, which comes with Dolby Vision, Dolby Vision IQ. It has HDR 10 plus, a wide color gamut. The overall acoustic experience is also truly breathtaking. 40 watt speakers with Dolby Atmos and DTSX. And of course, the software, that's also truly groundbreaking with Google TV, with Patchwall, and Chromecast, as well as Google Assistant built in. So that was the X Pro series. And let's take a quick look at a video to see what all it brings to a table.
Thank you. So those are the amazing products. And now for the point that you have all been waiting for to talk about the pricing, I'd like to invite Murli back on stage, please. Wow. And I just went by and don't think we quite realized it. Uh, I think Xiaomi is fortunate to have some of the best brand and product storytellers in the business. Put your hands together for Anuj Sharma, Gautam Batra, and Sandeep Sharma. Fantastic. Thank you. All right. So four different product categories, eight different SKUs. This is going to take a while, but I'll make this engaging and interesting. Let's start with the Xiaomi Smart Air Purifier 4. That device with a large effective coverage area of 516 square feet, triple layer protection. There is the pre-filter, there is the HEPA filter, there is the activated carbon filter, and that smart ionizer. The Xiaomi Smart Air Purifier 4 retails <laughs> for rupees 13,999. There is an early sale available on me.com, me homes and all of our retail partners on the 20th of April at 12 noon. And it is also going to be available on amazon.in on the 23rd of April at 12 noon. But hey, this is the Xiaomi Fan Festival. And therefore, we have an additional bank offer from ICICI Bank. Thank you. From ICICI Bank covering debit cards, credit cards, and EMI, 750 rupees instant discount in online channels, 750 rupees cashback in offline channels. That brings the effective price of the Xiaomi Smart Air Purifier 4 to just rupees 13,249. Thank you. Next, we have the Smart Air Purifier 4 Lite, which has all the goodness of the Big Brother, but with one major difference, that cool, calm, that fantastic, compact form factor, just right for that home office or that one-bedroom flat or that studio apartment. The Xiaomi Smart Air Purifier 4 Lite starts... <laughs> And just rupees 9,999 available on me.com, me home, and all of our offline retail partners starting 12 noon on the 20th of April and on both Flipkart and Amazon on the 23rd of April at 12 noon. The Xiaomi Fan Festival Bank offer also applies here. 500 rupee instant discount or cash back depending on the channel, bringing down the effective price. To just rupees 9,499. <laughs> Moving on to that other product that did a fun, wonderful jig out there on the stage, the Xiaomi Robo Vacuum Mop 2i with powerful suction capacity of 2,200 pascals, beautiful smart compact design, two-in-one cleaning and mopping capability with that zigzag uh, uh, cleaning pattern and the ability to control it smartly from your app, regardless of where you are. The Xiaomi Robo Vacuum Mop 2i retail for just rupees 16,999. The early sale starts on me.com, me home, and all of our retail partners on the 25th of April at 12 noon and available online on Amazon.in starting the 28th of April at 12 noon. The Xiaomi Fan Festival Bank offer also applies on the Robo Vacuum Mop 2i. 1,000 rupee instant discount or cash back depending on the channel, bringing down the effective price to just 15,999. <laughs> Moving on to our grooming game. The Xiaomi Beard Trimmer 2C with 90 minutes of runtime, 40 different lens settings, and that much needed USB C type far charging, 5 minutes charge, 10 minutes of use time. The Xiaomi Beard Trimmer 2C retails for just rupees 1,199. And you know what? 
The early sale starts today at 4 p.m. on me.com. And of course, it is also available from the 16th of April, 12 noon at Me Homes, our offline retail partners, Flipkart and Amazon.n. And we also have an early bird offer as part of the Xiaomi Fan Festival, wherein the beer trimmer 2C for the next three days will be available at just rupees 1099. Now, for those who want that complete head to toe grooming solution, we have the Xiaomi grooming kit, which has half a millimeter precision, 40 different lens settings, comes with multiple attachments, which Gotham very elegantly spoke about. The Xiaomi grooming kit retails for just 1,799. I mean, each of those products, if you were just just to buy the, the trimmer or a, or a nose hair trimmer in isolation in the market. There are products that are perhaps priced a lot more than that. This packs everything into one at just rupees 1,799. Again, the early sale starts today at 4 p.m. on me.com and will be available starting 16th of April, 12 noon on Me Homes, our offline retail partners, Flipkart and Amazon. And there is a three-day special Xiaomi fan offer wherein oops, wherein the uh, Xiaomi grooming kit will be available for just rupees 1,699 for the next three days. Now coming to the showcase products of the afternoon, the Xiaomi Smart TV X Pro with a 4K display with Dolby Vision IQ, Dolby Atmos with 40 watt dual speakers and the first television from the Xiaomi family to come with Google TV. The Xiaomi Smart TV X Pro comes in three different sizes. The Xiaomi Smart TV X Pro 43 inch retails for just 39, 32,999 and there are exciting bank offers which bring the price down to just 31,499, so a bank offer of 1,500 rupees. Now, depending on different platforms, the bank offers could vary, but it is a 1,500 rupee bank offer, which brings the effective price to just 31,499 for the 43 inch variant of the Xiaomi Smart TV X Pro. Now, moving on, the, Smart, the Xiaomi Smart TV X Pro 50 inch, Retails for 41,999 and with a 2,000 rupee bank offer, with the bank offer being different on different platforms, the effective price comes down to under 40,000 at 39,999. And finally, the Xiaomi Smart TV X Pro 55 inch retails for 47,999 with a 2,000 rupee bank offer. It is 45,999 with the bank offer differing across different platforms. The Xiaomi Smart TV X Pro series goes on sale starting the 19th of April, 12 noon on me.com, me homes, our offline retail partners and Flipkart. We had a lot to pack in today as far, of, as far as our smarter living even goes, but we have some wonderful fans out here and we have something special lined up today at 6 p.m. as part of the Xiaomi Fan Festival. Do make it a point to attend this, but for everybody else, thank you so much for making it here this, this afternoon. We've had a wonderful time hosting this event for you, the Experience Zone would be opening up shortly. Do go check out these products. The team has put up a wonderful experience for us. Uh, I, I saw it in the morning and, and it's going to be fantastic. Do share your feedback for, uh, for us. Do share your feedback with us. Um, on that note, from Team Xiaomi, thank you very much for being here. Good luck, take care, and stay safe. Bye-bye. Dear Xiaomi fans,